Okay, so once you have logged in to your student portal, once you've got access to that, let's take a look at a few of the tools that you will want to use on, I want to say, a daily basis. At bare minimum, every single week, you need to be checking these tools, bare minimum, preferably every day. It doesn't take very long. Once you have access to the student portal, it's very easy to access your student email, Blackboard, as well as Grades First. Let's take a look first at your student email tool, which is going to be Microsoft Outlook. That is the tool that the City Colleges provides to you uh, as a student. Click on Microsoft Outlook, and it'll kick you over to uh, our mailbox. So yours will probably look similar to this. I've got a lot of messages in here. You will probably have uh, many messages as well. You're going to get messages from me and your other instructors. You'll get messages from advisors, as well as occasional messages from the colleges kind of announcing events that are going on on campus or scholarship opportunities, other things that may pertain to your interests. So the first thing you might notice when you log in here, besides the number of the messages that I have to read today is that this is a tool that you'll have to kind of get used to, right? You can go from your inbox over here to see any messages that maybe you sent to an instructor. It will also group a bunch of clutter all together for you so that uh, you can ignore maybe messages that are not as important. Still check your cl clutter folder though, uh, in case maybe an important message accidentally went in there. Um, maybe most importantly, you'll want to be able to compose a new message by clicking new up here at the top. And you'll see that the message composition window then pops up in the right here. It'll automatically populate your name here. And then you just type in, so for example, if you wanted to send me a message, dbias2 at cc.edu. That's me. I don't know who this is. That's nobody. This is me. Uh, D bias to pink DB. <laughs> That's me. Of course, you're going to want to add a subject. So something like first day email assignment. And then you'd compose your message here. Hi, Diego. Blah, blah, blah. Sincerely, you know your name. Send. And there we go. And if you want to make sure that the message actually did send, you can hit send items and it'll have it right in there. Be sure to check your inbox. I'm going to encourage you to do it daily, if not at least uh, once a week. 